Well, as we just said, the Nebraska State Fair, it's almost over. And for the third consecutive year, the final Sunday has been known for celebrating Hispanic heritage. Local 4's Leroy Triggs attended the celebration and joins us now in studio with more. Casey, it was a day full of music and dance. Dancers came from all over Nebraska to show their love for Hispanic culture. They also have a band from Mexico and other local acts performing tonight. Now, committee member Yolanda Chavez Nuncio says this is the perfect way to kick off Hispanic Heritage Month, which starts September 15th. She says just she just wants people to be proud of their roots because there's a large Hispanic population throughout Nebraska, saying the Latino community is filled with pride and has a lot to share. She said the Nebraska State Fair gives them a chance to share their culture with everyone. And what's also important is that children also participate in celebrating culture. I was just speaking with a group from Omaha from Lincoln, they've been dancing with their kids for 20 some years. That's generations, you know, that crosses generations. The group from, from Omaha has dancers from very like five years old or younger up through adults. Chavez Nocio says the dance groups teach kids a lot about their history and how to be proud of who they are. She says those kids will go on to be contributors to society. She also stated that they started preparing for this festival eight months in advance. There were regular meetings to ensure that everything went just as they hoped. She also mentioned that there were Im Mexican immigrants in Grand Island since the early 1900s. Casey, back to you. 